U.S. Space Force Trials Missile Sensor in Orbit The U.S. Space Force's Wide Field of View Geosynchronous Earth Orbit WFOV Geo testbed has successfully received its sensor's first light data. The large sensor provides overhead persistent infrared information from geosynchronous orbit to support hypersonic missile tracking, warning operations. According to the Space Force, the WFOV Geo sensor will help expand battlespace awareness, improve technical intelligence, and facilitate the development of new capabilities. The demonstration was led by experts from U.S. Space Systems Command in collaboration with the Boulder-based Tools, Applications, and Processing TAP, Laboratory. TAP Lab is ready to play a critical role in first light and subsequent calibration and experimentation phases that will lay the foundation to operationalize WFOV, TAP Lab Director Steve Polliard said. We're proud to be part of a tightly integrated team that brings together world-class researchers, developers, analysts, subject matter experts, and operators, ready to realize the full potential of this tremendous new asset in space. WFOV will enable us to showcase TAP Lab's unique ability to extract meaningful information from OPIR, overhead persistent infrared, data, while hosting critical ground functions such as mission planning and mission data processing. Faster than traditional sensors the WFOV geotestbed was launched aboard the USS F-12 mission rocket in July. It went online and completed bus checkout the following month. WFOV and the team at the TAP Lab are key contributors to the pivot of missile warning, missile tracking, as it will enhance data exploitation and streamline test and certification of non-traditional sensors into the architecture. This will enable the network to transmit validated data to the warfighter faster than with traditional sensors.